Hello and welcome to the Old Golden Black for this very short, very concise update about the Wolves goings on on the eve of the end of the transfer window. Uh, Wolves have uh, only signed Rafa Mir and have renewed uh, Morgan Gibbs White's contract or made him professional. Uh, now he's turned 18, so he's going to be at the club for the next four years, which is fantastic because he's shown really, really good potential over the last couple of months. Uh, but most excitingly today, uh, Wolves have confirmed that Diogo Jota will become a permanent Wolves player at the end of this season, which is fantastic and it's showing the potential and the ambition of the club uh, going forward now. And, you know, he's far and away the best uh, attacking player, I think, in the Championship and has shown that week in, week out, he can deal with the pace and the physicality of it. I think I watched the back uh, a couple of my videos from earlier on in this season and I talked about how he was a little bit slower to react uh, and to adapt to the championship. But I really only think that was after one or two games because he really shone then. Particularly the Villa game was one of his best games for us. I think uh, the Forest game away from home as well. Even Saturday uh, against Ipswich, although he's not been in a rich vein of scoring form, he certainly showed that he's capable of pulling off some really, really special uh, moves in the attacking third for Wolves. And he's definitely a Premier League player and hopefully, you know, he'll settle into life in the Premier League. It'll certainly be different for him compared to this year in the Championship. And, you know, we're still assuming that Wolves are going to be promoted as well. So somebody asked me on Saturday if I could do the maths behind Wolves' promotion. And I'll leave a link to the uh, document in the description down below. But basically, at the moment, Wolves need to get 106 points to get promoted because that is the most points that anybody else in the Championship can get. Uh, who are out of the top two. So Cardiff can only get 54 more points from their 18 games, and if they win every one of them, they'll get 105 points. Wolves at the moment, if they win all of their games, will get 51 more points, which will put them on 116 points. Derby will get 107 if they win all of theirs. So at the moment, it's 105, which will get us promoted. But then, of course, if we were to win and Cardiff were to lose, that would change week in, week out. I imagine... I think we'd be pretty unlucky to not get promoted with 90 points. I think we've seen teams before not get promoted with 89. So 90 is the sort of magic number. So hopefully we can get to that as soon as we can. It's 25 more points. So what's that? Nine more wins. And hopefully we can get that in the next couple of months. Thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to drop a like, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you later in the week. Bye-bye.